Monday and happy brand new weekly vlog. Hope you're all doing well. I don't think this weekly vlog is going to be a very long one, entertaining one, but I'm going to try and do a study with me tomorrow, which is going to be like part of the weekly vlog, which will mainly be it. But um, basically, me and Dan are going to London on Friday, so that will be a separate vlog for the weekend. Valentine's night, you know the drill. Um, come surprising him with like bits and bobs up there so thought that'd be interesting and um yeah so today's monday i have got a normal day i've got a couple days for before my deadline photography it's going to plan i'm really happy because i'm not behind i've taken all my pictures and stuff so that is a bonus definitely um but yeah that is pretty much it i've got work at three so i've got to leave college and go straight there until five i'm still training so i'm still training to do like coffees and stuff but hopefully after today and um, they can see kind of like i've done loads of work last night on it so hopefully they can see i've improved but um yeah i'm just gonna grab some breakfast and then head off to college i'll see you guys while. Um, hi everyone and um, it's now tuesday um, I'm a very bad vlogger, as you can tell I didn't vlog anything yesterday. Um, but today is going to be the main day of this vlog because it only runs over a couple of days. So I'm going to be doing a study with me. Doing the, my last bits of my photography deadline. It's on Thursday, so my knees crack on. I'm just going to show you like my evening, basically. So it's more like a study with me evening thing. Um, but yeah, I'm off to college now to do sociology and then I'm going to come. Because I have no effort for college anymore. Yay! So guys, it's late now. I have gone home. Oh my god, getting home was painful. It was so windy. I walked home from the train station. It was so windy. It was like I was blowing over. Like Storm Chiara is killing us all. Um, but yeah, now I'm home and I'm like fresh. Um, my hair is really greasy, so apologies for that. But um, I am washing it tonight. But I just thought I'm doing so much work that. I don't need to wash it just yet. I just want to kind of get on with it. So I'm going to grab a drink. I'm going to make myself a hot chocolate. Um, not a hot chocolate, a tea. And then I... What are we going to do? We're going to do photography, Nala. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to do my photography. So let's crack on. I'm going to show you the tea I have been using. Isn't sponsored or anything, but I did get it gifted. So... There's a lot of like stigma around like gifted products and whether um, influencers influence and actually use it. I do for a fact. Um, some things more than others, but this is definitely something I've been using. And this is tea pigs. Oh my god, I love it. Okay, so I'm going to try and show you the best possible way that I can. But obviously, it is a project and it is like um, March and everything. I'm kind of just, it is a, the deadline is Thursday, so I just want to kind of crack on, complete it to the best it can be. I can't do it tomorrow because I've got one lesson for photography, so I can have like an hour and a half to just do top ups, make sure everything's perfect. But my main priority tomorrow is to cut out my contact sheets because I can't do that at home because I don't have the software for it. So I need to cut out um, one contact sheet, um, the other ones I've done. So all I've got to do today is do analysis of a few photos. I've got to stick a few photos in, do my statement of intent, do the end of it and everything like that. So first thing I'm actually going to do is going to... I've wrote out, basically, I'm going to show you in a second. I've wrote out what pages are going to go where. But I'm basically going to focus on my mum's shoot because I know what I'm doing there and I know how I'm doing it. So, yeah, I'm just going to go through that. I'm going to look on how I'm going to lay it out and I'll show you guys when I'm doing it. This is one of my artists and I'm basically using my mum and me for this kind of section. I'm basically going to put loads of old pictures and things and this is going to be like my mum's little section. So, yeah, that's all good.
These are the pictures I've printed out. Here's little baby Brooke, and then that's little Lorraine. So I've got like little baby pictures of us. And I just thought this would be nice because it is my personal project. I obviously didn't take these pictures. Um, I'd been a very skilled photographer if I had, but I thought it would just be nice to kind of lay them out like this. Um, this is the rest of my sketchbook. I will obviously show you the end result, but yes. So this is gonna go just here. It's gonna go here. of me and mum as children that's weird thought I'd also show you that I've added a little bit in if you didn't watch my weekly vlog last week you wouldn't have seen any of it but I added that in as well done some art because I'm an artist no I'm joking I hate art but I've tried to make this a little bit artistic um I added in the pictures so they're all just around and then up here I'm going to do final image number three um because yeah that's how I want it. But basically, I've just printed out um, four of the same images, but in different filters, different edits, and I'm going to do it using different, like, um, light and things. So, yeah, the, the pictures come out really not great on this um, printer because they come out liney, but it's all good. I've basically wrote them out and I've mixed a paint. I use these paints. I got these from the works and they are so good. I got them for £3. They literally have lasted me the whole sketchbook. I haven't had to buy any new ones. I've literally, that was definitely one of the good buys and I bought some paint brushes from the works and it came to like £5. But I mixed some grey because I thought the grey would look kind of nice on this page. Then I'm going to do a title and then I'm just writing down this. This is basically all about different lighting. Nala, no, 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 no. I think Nala definitely needs to go out. Um, because last time she went on my sketchbook when it had all paint on it and she got it all on her paws and like started walking around. I was like, oh my God. It's because um, it's like a running concept thing in Madrid. She's come home and told me a better idea of the whole idea. Um, okay. Um... an idea of like a prison kind of like storylines i'm basically looking at storylines online and um, for the mum one of waiting to come home i kind of just like picked a random thing for that but so it is literally half past six and i'm almost done lads i've just printed out my statement of intent to cut out and print and stick and all that so i'm doing that i need to print a few pictures off tomorrow at college because my print is like being a bit liney at the minute and i would rather them not be liney if you get what i mean um so yeah i'm not printing them off just yet but i'm gonna stick in my statement of intent cut it out nicely i'm pretty much done i'm so happy that it's done and finished and i'm pretty much all completed hopefully fingers crossed nothing bad happens or anything like he says oh you need to do another shoot tomorrow <laughs> something that he would do but yeah i will show you it i'm just currently i've basically done this i don't really like it very much like this is probably my worst thing i've done i don't know i just not falling in love um on it but i will show you everything i'm just gonna tidy up let this dry and then i'll show you the whole entire sketchbook i need to print off a few pictures but i'm printing them off tomorrow
downstairs, put a bath on, um, because I need a bath, I need to brush my hair and things. Um, and I'm going to show you some gifted products I got today, which I actually only got one gifted product. I'm sounding like I got a million gifted products, but I didn't. I've got one gifted product. Oh, no, no. Now, let's hit. I'll show you the gifted product I use. I just use my messy background. Oh, oh my god, this is so heavy. So I got such a cool um gifted product. I got such a cool PR package today. I got it from this company called Mask Time. I hadn't heard of these, but then Instagram found them on there, and then we decided that they were gonna send me up some um products to try and review and see what they're like and i love this holographic bag that they come in i find that so cool um and then when i opened them up they came with four different masks um yep that's what they came with um they came with a tea tree mask they came with a with this an assessments mask Came with a honey mask and they came with a rose hip mask. This is actually from like Korean masks, but they are based in America and things and stuff. Really easy to deliver and things. Um so yeah, thank you guys so much. I'll link these below because I always love showing you guys what I get sent. But I also thought I'd also show you. This is what I keep all my face masks in, or majority of them, not my ones that I actually put on my face. Um and I wanted to just show you how many face masks. That I've got which is just ridiculous you don't really understand guys so I have got this one which is a weird looking mask that Dan got me for Christmas and I can't wait to one day use it I might use that when I go on holiday got some um, little cucumber sheet masks got a glam glow one which is amazing I love these ones got a oxygen bubble mask I got this eye patch and Sarah got me that got a Thailand mask and then I've got two more Glam Glow masks. I am all sucked up with face masks. The only thing is with these ones that they never fit face right. So I'm hoping the ones I've been sent fit my face all nicely. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'm going to have a bath tonight. Um, have some little chill time. I'm honestly like, I don't think sometimes you give people giving each other like enough credit. And I don't think a lot of the time people give themselves enough credit. And for me, I'm so proud that I managed to do the personal project. Because I knew that, obviously I came into photography late and things. And I knew that it would be a struggle. And I knew that there would be a lot of things that were challenging in photography. And I'm just really proud of myself. My pictures may not be the best in the world. My layout may not be the best in the world. But for me, I am really proud of myself. And as cringe as that sounds, I've put so much. I've put hours and hours and hours. I've been doing this since 2 o'clock. It's now quarter past seven, so I've been doing it for five hours, and I'm literally just cracking on, and I've just been so happy with how it's done, and I'm also not stressing about it on the night before. Um, I've left it at a good time, and this is something that I think is really important, that you show efficiency, and it can really kind of show that if you plan yourself out, it works so much better. Um, but yes, so for now, I'm literally going to um, sort out my diary because i need to check little bits and bobs and yeah just do some bits and bobs and i will show you my portrait photography week holder when i'm downstairs because i'm gonna stay up here for now and have a bath and everything like that he's clean this beauty room as well oh um downstairs tonight because obviously he's got rugby and then he comes here i don't know why we always get him the messy time but um yeah that's pretty Hi, much good it. morning happy wednesday um Dan and me didn't wake up for our alarm today. Well, he goes earlier than me, but um, yeah, I didn't wake up for it. So he was late. We had to get him a cab because he there was no other actual way to get to college apart from this bus that he normally gets on. So that was great. Um, quality timekeeping from us. But anyway, I've got college. I'm gonna hand. Well, I'm gonna finish off my personal project. Just sit the last pictures in. Then I will try and show you on my phone. I'm gonna keep it there at college. Um. But yeah, and tonight I'm going to see Mabel, so that'll be really exciting to vlog. This vlog is quite an exciting one. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to see Mabel tonight. I'm going to go to college, do that day, and then come home and go. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. So everyone, I am ready, and I'm ready for Mabel. Got picked up early because they weren't really doing anything in college. We were literally sitting there playing coat. Like, I'm like, what a throwback. And so I decided to come home early because I was like, I'm not waiting around for this. So I came home, got ready. I am wearing this. So I haven't had a tan, and if you're like me, girls, you know that when you 
a living you live for tans and you have tans pretty much every week when you haven't got one because i'm basically saving it for a nice one on valentine's because i'm obviously going to london this weekend which will be in a separate vlog but i am basically white as a pale ghost so i have had to kind of cover up on all sorts of reasons so got this really cute hat on that i love and you guys know i love this then i'm wearing a really basic outfit but it kind of is cute i'm wearing my baby girl t-shirt which i wear quite often i'm wearing these cargo camouflage bottoms and then i'm wearing some white air forces um i'm gonna pop some hoops in and then yeah i kind of just wanted to go chill i know it's quite a young vibe and things but yeah i'm really excited i think me and mum are gonna go to um get some food before and stuff and yeah we're standing i'll try and get as much footage as i can obviously i'll be filming on my phone because i don't want to take my massive camera i've also just had a really cute package pr package from the lovely company of kate and chloe now i haven't actually got downstairs with me because i've done a little instagram of it upstairs but i just thought i'd show you it's here I, it was basically the 18 karat gold gold plated princess halo study rings they're like emerald and they are lush like oh my god they're so beautiful but yeah really excited i love mabel she is one of my favorites and i love her new album i've been listening to it all day getting in the spirit and yeah Right knobs. Like, away. If you're watching this, don't flick your hair on my face. <laughs> Taste story time. Story time, we get home. <laughs> yeah, we're on our way home. Wow, what a good night. I enjoyed that so much. Like, I have always really liked Mabel. She's been like really, really cool and everything, but she's never been like amazingly not amazingly she's never been like one of my favorites or anything i've just liked her music a lot of the time she was amazing she was so good but yeah it's quite late now it's like almost 12 so i've got to go to sleep i'm so tired I'm, i've got college tomorrow but it's basically half a day it's like a, a open day in the evening so i'm only in for half a day and if i can be bothered to get up i will go in but if not I won't go in because quite frankly can't be asked um, and that's why my attendance is so bad like i have really bad attendance at the minute but hopefully next term it will get cleared but yeah apart from that i will see you tomorrow for the last day of the weekly vlog and then we'll switch over to my uh, thursday so i think today i am going to be doing an evening routine because i think i've actually really done evening routine on this channel so i'm going to do one because i'm home early i didn't go to photography because everyone basically the plan was to just give in um, your sketchbook but i gave him mine yesterday so there was actually no need for me to go so that was very handy um but yeah so i think we're doing even routine tonight so that means i won't be really vlogging too much but i thought it'd be kind of cool 
um like evening after two afternoon routine so after school routine so yeah that's what i'm gonna do i think um but i will catch in with you guys and all that but this vlog's probably been quite long anyway so it's all good so now I'm speaking to you, but I have been doing my evening routine, but I really, really quickly want to show you the PR package I didn't show yesterday. This is from the company Kate and Chloe. Hadn't heard of them, but then we got in contact and they wanted to send me up something, which was so lovely of them. So yeah, thank you guys so much. I will link them below because I would obviously want you guys to see and everything. I'll link all the brands that I've spoken about down below, but look how beautiful these are. I had no idea they were going to send me out such beautiful ones. They are some earrings and they're like emerald and I've never had anything like this. I've got a ring that's quite similar to it so I'm really, really excited to wear these. They are the 18 Carat Emerald Rose Stud Earrings and I literally love them. I'm going to pop them on. I'm going to head to London on the weekend and I'm going to wear them for Valentine's because they're so pretty. I literally love them. So yeah. Apart from that, I'm just doing like a little bit, I'm doing a lot of cleaning, I'm doing like, um, like tidying lots of bits and bobs up, but yeah. So guys, I thought I'd just end this weekly vlog, I hope you've really, really enjoyed it, it's actually been quite interesting weekly vlog, so I really hope you have. If you aren't subscribed already, make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you very, very soon, bye.